Tonight, only Action News Jax is hearing from a man with local ties who was on this toppled bus from a cruise excursion in the Bahamas. Now that cruise started in Jacksonville, as Action News Jax first told you. The bus lost control and crashed. Four people were seriously hurt. More than two dozens went to the hospital. It was quite a chaotic and uh, kind of a scary event. The ship returned to Jacksport today. All new at 10, Action News Jax Russell Colbert joins us live in Arlington. Russell, Nick Dale tells you there were some horrific injuries. Yeah, things he will not soon forget. And he actually is a nursing student in Georgia, but he started his college career right here at JU. And he and his buddy left from Jacksonville for a spontaneous trip for their summer break, but they never expected this. Nick Dale and Chase Hollingsworth aboard the Carnival Ecstasy. It was literally just a kind of spontaneous summer trip. Monday, they rode this ferry from the ship to Eleuthera for a day-long cave excursion, which they'd take a bus to get to. I was looking out the window one second. Next thing I know, a tree branch is hitting the bus, and we're spinning sideways. The bus flipped, crashing near Rock Sound. There was a lot of people that were injured, uh, and, you know, the first thing that you think about is, you know, am I okay? And you know, and it, are the people I'm with okay? Uh, and then I immediately started to react and looked in for other people to see if they were all okay. Nursing students, both men started triaging people and getting them away from the bus. There was lots, lots of lacerations, so lots of blood. Uh, there's a couple people that were pinned inside the bus. Nick and Chase worked for about 20 minutes before being joined by nurses headed to work and paramedics. Injuries for four people were so severe they were flown elsewhere for care. 28 others were treated at area hospitals. No other vehicles were involved in the crash, which remains under investigation. Dale says his actions that day are just what anyone would do. And when you're in a situation like that, it shows the best of humanity. I think that the people were that responded, um, they responded as best as they could. And all new at 11, Dale will tell us about a teen he remembers helping who was pinned under that bus. Meantime, Carnival has suspended all operations by the tour operator and says they're working to help the families impacted. Reporting live, Russell Colburn, Fox 30, Action News Jax.